but uh, staying positive, trying to actually stay involved and be a part of the team. What can you do now, and what can't you do, and do you expect to play this week? Um, I mean, you can ask the coaches and the trainers more about what's specifically going on. I don't want to yeah, bore you with the details to try to get into it, but um, basically, yeah, it's just kind of a thing that they thought would heal faster, and it's really not getting much better, but uh, I don't know, it's kind of a wait and see, you know, see what's going to happen. But Where's it at now versus where it was a couple weeks ago? Um, trying to think. I don't know. You got ask, I'd ask the trainers and the coaches. I kind of, it's kind of a thing where it's, it's, it's a bizarre thing, but it's kind of it's a nerd type deal. It's kind of not getting much better. How difficult has it been for you to kind of just sit back and see the defense like struggle the way it has? Um, I mean, obviously, you know, you want to be able to be out there and help your team. Mm-hmm. Uh, something that yeah, you know, love to be out there and be playing and helping out and doing whatever I can. But uh, so you know, staying involved, you know, with the game plan and trying to help, you know, whoever's out, whoever's in there, trying to help them out and uh, trying to you know see what what they're gonna let me do, what they can let me do, and you know, yeah. go from there. What are you noticing like on film or when you go back and you actually get a chance to see how the others are performing? Um, I mean, everyone's, you know, playing hard. I mean, there's not an effort from Everyone's doing their job playing hard. It's just, you know, something we got to, you know, obviously, you know, do a better job on defense. What do you tell James Morris when he goes out there as a, you know, true freshman? Yeah, I mean, he's, he's a great athlete. He's a good kid. He, I've roomed with him all throughout camp. And uh, actually, every uh, hotel, every time we go to the hotel for games, I room with him. You know, he's a great kid. And I'm just, you know, I'm telling him, you know, you're a great athlete. You know, just play confident. And uh, he's, he's a very smart kid. He's picking up stuff pretty quick, so that's pretty uh, good to see, definitely. Is it one of those things where he's coming up to you and, you know, getting your take on things, or is it more you just kind of passing things along with him, especially like right now? Yeah, no, he'll, I, yesterday at practice, he'll come to me and be like, hey, you know, is this doing right, or what happens if they do this? And it's kind of, you know, nice I can be there and help him out and kind of tell him so he's not, you know, he's bugging coach. Coach is trying to coach the other players that are in there. And uh, definitely I'm trying to, yeah, you know, help him out as much as I can. And then other things, you know, I'll try to point him out and say, hey, you can do this differently or just, you know, try try this out, see what you feel about this. But, yeah, it's definitely something we're both kind of working with each other and you know, outside a lot. Are you worried that this thing's going to linger all season and maybe you don't get back out there again? <laughs> and obviously it's something, you, you know, you can't, you can't control, so you try not to think about it too much. You know, you don't want to, you know, get down on yourself and just start getting, you know, frustrated about it because you really just got to stay positive. And I've been trying to stay positive through the whole process. And, uh, yeah, I mean, obviously that would, that would not be what I was looking for. <laughs> it didn't get better the whole season. But, uh, you know, it's still going to make progress and, you know, just go from there. How do you stay positive? Um, I mean, yeah, it's, 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 I mean, obviously I've been here before. I hate to say it, practice, you know, with injuries or whatnot, but something that happens in sports, and, you know, it's obviously one of the only negatives in sports is, you know, injuries and something you have to deal with. And uh, you just got to, you know, stay stay positive, stay, you know, part of the team, keep with the game plan, you know, help out any way you can and look at it, you know. It's really not, I mean, it could be worse. You know, it's, yeah. not, it's not like, you know, my life's all or anything, you know. There's a lot of other terrible things going on that you really, you know, my situation is not that bad. You know. Is it hard? <laughs> is it hard not to look at the clock and see it ticking and the, the you know, time's running out for you here? Yeah, I mean, obviously it's something you kind of you know have in the back of your mind, but you're just you really. I just try to take it day to day and stay positive and do my treatments the best I can and do everything, you know, whether it's stay in the game mentally. Like I've been watching, you know, trying to game plan every week. Like every week I watch this much film like I'm going to be playing. So I'm, you know, if I do, you know, get a chance to come back, it's not like I'm like, oh, what am I doing here? Like. Trying to just focus on every week and prepare like I would normally, and that's something I do to stay in the game.